everyone i am gaurav rajkumar singh rathod welcome to fly rajputs towards infinity and in this video we going to learn how to draw the directrix of an ellipse and find the eccentricity of the ellipse so uh, this question is pretty similar to the previous one the only difference is in this question they have asked us to draw the directrix and find the eccentricity so the question is construct an ellipse having a major axis as 100 mm and minor axis 80 mm long locate its foci so till here the question is pretty similar to the previous one so i will not be solving that part of the question if you want to know how to solve that part of the question you have to watch my previous video so i will be solving only directrix and the fi and find the eccentricity that part of the question so first of all we will need to draw the ellipse using the previous method okay so we have drawn the ellipse using arc of circle method now we have to calculate the eccentricity first because we have two formulas for calculating eccentricity one will get us the value of eccentricity and another formula will help us to get the distance of the directrix from the point a so the first is distance of distance between the foci divided by the major axis so eccentricity is equals to distance between foci divided by major axis so distance between foci is f1 f2 that much distance and the major axis is ab distance between f1 and f2 is 60 mm and ab is 100 mm so this will be 0.6 mm so eccentricity is equals to 0.6 mm now we have another formula of calculating eccentricity which is distance of a point from focus divided by the distance of that point from the directrix so the directrix will be here at point m from directrix okay so from here distance of the point let's say this point is f1 a so the distance of a from f1 is a f1 and distance of point a from the directrix m is a m we already have the value of eccentricity which, which is 0.6 and af this is 20 mm how this is 20 mm because the length of ab is 100 mm and this distance is 60 mm the rest is 40 mm which is 20 here and 20 here so this is 20 mm and am as it is so from here we can calculate am and am is equals to 20 divided by 0.6 which is 33.3 mm so the distance of directrix from point a is 33.3 mm so what we need to do is we will extend this line ab 33.3 mm till point m and here also 33.3 mm from b at point n and we will draw a directrix on both the points so this is directrix dd and here will be dt s and d s so this is how we can calculate the eccentricity and we can draw the directrix of an ellipse if you like the content then please click on the like button do share this video to all your colleagues and don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you have any question you can ask in the comment section below